So I'm back out here with Guap. Guap, I talked to you, I can't remember if it was like last year sometime, but how have you been since then? Been all right, the same, same stuff every day. Okay, and uh, still out here on the streets? Yeah. And it looks like you just got out of jail. That's where that paperwork is coming from, right? Yeah. What were the charges? Um, trespassing. When you get uh, caught up for trespassing, do they just let you go? They just uh, let you go right away or what? Usually they let you go. Sometimes they don't, but you got to go to your court. Is that what they told you? Like, well, yeah. we're going to let you go, but you got to come back for court? Yeah. When's your next court date? In a couple months. Do you think it will make it? Yeah, I'll make it. Do they tell you if you don't go, what's going to happen to you? Yeah, that you're going to go to jail. You're going to get a warrant. Um, so yeah, lots of people that I talk to get uh, picked up for trespassing. So what were you doing? Were you like just sleeping somewhere where you shouldn't have been? Or how does that work? Yeah, that's, that's what happened. Okay. Uh, before you're also using blues, have you, you still using blues a little bit, a lot, or the same? Not really the same. Okay. Also, you're telling us about the music you're making. How's that going? It's going good. I should I should be able to get a break maybe soon, co coming up, hopefully. But um, when I start recording, I'll probably be able to go viral then because I got stuff like medicine, ways to get it done to make it go viral and stuff like that. But... When it does go viral, hopefully I capitalize on it then. I should, you know what I'm saying? So are you like working on an album or you have, you just need a couple songs or like a, 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 a solo or what? I'll be able to do a whole album off the, off the work I've done. That I've been building, building on it, the album, for quite some time now, like the past three years. How old are you now? Uh, 31. And how long have you been doing music? How, how old were you when you started? Like young, young. Like around 23 years, somewhere around that. So it's been a long time you've been working on music, huh? Yo. Do you have any anything that you can, uh, a little sample that you give us right now? I can't really do it right now. I'm not in the mood right now. I can't do it when I'm not in the mood. Yeah. How are you feeling now that you came out? Like, are you tired? Are you, uh, what, what, when you, when people get out of jail, like, what's their feel? They're happy or are you upset because you just got to get out? Or mad that I, it, it, that I got locked up in the first place. Cause I was on my way to court when I was, before I got locked up and I had the, my bus pass. So I was allowed on the right light rail, but I couldn't find my light rail. It disappeared on my bus pass. It disappeared. And then I got arrested for that. So they got they picked you up on the light rail. Yeah, and I was on my way to court. Because on the light rail you have to have a ticket to be on there, right? Yeah, and, and I had a bus pass. Okay. But it disappeared. Somebody took it, probably. It just disappeared. It's like some magic trick. And the police didn't believe in magic tricks, huh? No. Uh, yeah, that's unfortunate. Uh, what are your plans today, Guap? Go back over to Twenty Seventh and Bethany over there she was good over there does your family know that you're out here guap probably yeah well they know i'm out here on the streets but they don't know exactly where i'm at right now do they ever try to help you sometimes do you want the help that they're trying to offer or no Not yeah yet. yeah yeah okay uh since last time I talked to you, do you think there's been more people out here in the streets or less or the same? Probably more people. Why do you think it's more and more people every year? What's happening, Wop? I think they're doing that. They're doing something to make people lose out on work and shit. They're doing something to make them lose out on work and make them homeless because they want to have feel control, feel uh, better, get that better feeling to themselves. 
This is like a master plan, a plan, master plan from somebody you think or what? Probably. I'm also noticing uh, your like neck. You're not able to. So last time I met you, you're upright. You're able. You're walking upright. Today you're a little bit slumped. It's that little that neck. Yeah. So, you're. I see this with a lot of people, and uh, the chemicals in blues, uh, they were so bad that they make uh, your bones like early onset of osteoporosis, like brittle bones. And so you'll see curvature of the back and curvature of the neck uh, on a lot of people, people that are in their 20s, uh, 30s. And, and I don't wanna say it's because of the pills, but the pills don't help, right? Yeah. So have you noticed that about about your, your neck, your back? Yeah, I noticed it. How do you feel about that? It's, uh, it's dark magic. By applied by who? Who's uh, putting black mag uh, black magic? It's a group of people. So you got people out there, little haters that uh, are just putting this black magic on you to. Yo. What are your? How are you gonna uh, defend yourself against that? She's probably doing the same to them. Black magic against them. Yeah. Man. We don't, we don't want that affecting your music though, right? Yeah, right. We don't want it affecting your album, your your music. Have you ever gone on tour or anything? No. Not yet? Not yet. Okay. Um, when can people look forward to you dropping your album? In the next two years. Do you think that'll be through like YouTube or where? Where can people- Probably on YouTube, Pandora, iTunes, SoundCloud. Do you have like an album name? I uh, saw. So Trap Air Risa. What's that? Trap Air Risa. Trap Air Risa? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so that people can go, you know, in the next two years, go search out your music to, uh, you know, to, to uh, support you, right? You want support. Yeah. You're trying to go viral and let the world know your musical abilities. Uh, that, yeah, maybe that, maybe music is what's going to get you out of here, huh? Yeah, maybe. In the next six months, where will you be? Guap? I'm not sure in the next six months. Maybe still out here on the street. When do you think you're going to be off the streets? How long will that take? It might take a while. When I get housing, if I get housing, I should get out the streets by then. And like what, how do you think you'll get housing? By just asking the um, the clinic I go to. So there's clinics that all you have to do is go and ask and they'll give you housing? Yeah. What's the name of that clinic? Tarot's, they put you on a waiting list. To get housing, like what, an apartment, a house? An or apartment what? or a house. Really? Yo. Do they have any requirements? You gotta be SMI. Severely mentally ill? Yeah. Do you qualify for that? Yeah. How long have you been suffering with your SMI? Not sure. Past couple years or so. Did was there SMI first, then blues, or blues caused the SMI? Probably blues caused the SMI. Do you think it's Do you think it's time to stop with the blues to, before it makes it worse, or what? What do you think? Yeah, I'm really using that. No. No. Are you so you've kind of weaned down like uh, before you used to do more and now you're it's less or what? Yeah. Uh, the first time I met you, how many were you doing per day? Like four. And now you're down to what? Like none. None? Yeah. So you're pretty much sober, huh? Yo. How do you how'd you do that? Just uh, stay focused. Maintain. Discipline. Yeah, do what I got to do. Okay, so you're sober, and what what what's next? Trying to get a job. What type of job would you be interested in? Something that deals with people, referrals, something like that. You want to deal with people? Yeah. Nothing with music, huh? Well, of course, something with music, but um, I don't think I'm gonna find that in a nine to five. Right. Yeah. 
So, uh, Guap, I'm going to say thank you very much for talking to me. It was uh, nice seeing you. I'm glad you still, you're still among us, you're still alive. So many people that I, I've talked to, they didn't make it to 2024, unfortunately, okay? It was, uh, 2023 was a rough year for some people. They didn't, they didn't make it, okay, because of these blues. So, um, thank you. Stay safe, and we'll talk soon, okay? All right.